are you a member of a political party? 68% said yes, they were members of the ANC. And 8% said they were members of the SACP. We also asked them about leadership positions within the parties. More of them had leadership positions within the SACP than within the ANC. If the SACP were to contest the next election, would you vote for it? And 44% of them said yes. In 1992, no question was asked about this, although 9% of shop stewards thought the South African Communist Party would represent their interests best in the negotiations at CODESA. We asked a lot of questions about unions, their role in politics, their alliance, moving on from political parties, and this is what they had to say, that workers should influence the political system, the top union leaders should be leaders in political parties, and that workers should be represented in their communities by civics. This figure was lower compared to these. Their views on the alliance between COSATU ANC and the SACP, they still maintained that COSATU should support the ANC in the next election, that COSATU should continue as a member of the alliance, that conditions of workers have improved, and that COSATU should have a say on who should lead the ANC. So pretty much within the alliance here. What is your view of the state of the tripartite alliance? And this is where the figures start to change a bit. A third of them said that they thought the alliance was poor. Half of them thought that the state of the alliance was good. If you attended the ANC conference in Mangaung, who would you prefer for the position of president of the ANC? When this question was asked, they were not given options. It was an open question, no readouts, and these were the answers that they came up with themselves. And the next slide has the provincial breakdown, which makes for a little bit more interesting viewing. We did ask a lot of questions. We, we disaggregated the data by ethnicity, by gender, by race, by province. And what was interesting here was that if you look at, if you come down the provinces, that Jacob Zuma had you know, support, majority support in two, of, in two, in two provinces. And this is where um, Kalema Motlante had equal support. And in these provinces, he actually had more support than Jacob Zuma. So more provinces having support for Kalema Motlante. We asked a question about direct representation, moving on to forms of um, you know, how our political architecture is. And this was about direct representation. Shop stewards have that experience because they vote for the person, for the shop steward. Whereas politically, we vote for the political party. And in all of these, the figures was they disagreed. So they still maintained that one should vote for the political party, but this is, quite a significant and quite a, a big minority that they would say South Africans should vote directly for the president of the country, not the party, directly for the mayor, not the party. And we found that to be interesting because there are discussions about our political system and how everything is structured. We then asked a few questions on workers and society. Trade unions must worry more about worker issues than societal issues. If there was a national economic crisis, workers must be protected before the concerns of the unemployed. Society comes first before workers, and that's when it starts to drop. Teachers, government must force teachers to go to work. They didn't agree with that. And um, a lot of them are SATU members, as was pointed out by, by Eddie. But yes, uh, putting workers before society and their position in society. Whether public representatives should be subjected to lifestyle audits, a high percentage, 83% said yes. Labor brokers should be banned, 80%. And 43% thought that a youth wage subsidy was a good thing. We asked questions on corruption. 91% said that corruption is increasing and it goes down. Too many people in government are corrupt. This was good. Corruption Watch will enhance the fight against corruption. 78% of them thought yes. The police are corrupt, well, there is corruption in, 
this was an interesting figure, that there is corruption in some of our unions, that they were open about it. In fact, in all unions, two-thirds or more of shop stewards agreed that there is corruption in some of our unions. In all provinces, the majority of shop stewards also agreed that there is corruption. <laughs>